were told to go for souls and go for the worst. So I think that is the heart of our theology. Oh, look, I think it's at the very heart of salvationist theology. The last, the lost, the least, um, soup, soap, salvation, right from the start. Ah, it's just, we go back to our roots, don't we? We think of the Wesleyan impact on our theology. And so for the Salvation Army, boundless grace is that it is for all. Whosoever will may be saved. And so boundless grace is very much at the heart of what we do because uh, we're available to the whosoever in this world. It's who we are. We follow Jesus. We follow his example. If you have this boundless grace in yourself, the more every day you will be like Jesus. You know, there's a great Salvation Army song. I think that's at the heart of the mission of the Salvation Army. Is he came to give us life in all its fullness. He came to make the blind to see. He came to banish death and doubt and darkness. He came to set his people free. If you have that boundless grace that comes from God, the more that you will also going to uh, uh, connect and inspire and transform others because of that uh, boundless grace. Really when we do life together and we pick each other up and we go on, that's Salvation Army. And hopefully it'll continue in, in uh, having a central part in Salvo Theology. Mm -hmm.